Yet another commenter pointed out that different regions of the country have different natural carrying capacities, and that the distribution of populations in the U.S. is completely untethered from a region's natural carrying capacity because of modern supply chains and distribution. He is correct about this, but like I said in the last video, human migration is very hard to model in advance. And there are certainly some areas of the country that are further from major population centers and have higher densities of animals that would fare better in this regard than others. That's why I outlined looking into your county's population of people versus population of animals in the last video. This will vary a lot from county to county, so I put the link to the radius tool I used in the last video in the description of both that video and this one. In the last video, I was just showing that the population of Chicago is just one tank of gas away from anywhere in the Midwest. But you can use that tool to see how many people are within one tank of gas of you. You just enter your city or county name and the radius you want it to check up to 500 miles. And it'll tell you how many people live in that radius from you. As discussed in the last video, fuel-efficient sedans get 400-ish miles per tank these days, so I'd use that as your planning factor. Whereas you never can be sure which direction people will go in after an incident, it'd be a good idea to see how many people there are within one tank of gas from you and use that in your planning.